What does Harry Smith have in common with a Florida sixth grader, Damon Weaver? Well, they are both in rarefied air, some of the few people who've gotten to interview a president, President Obama. I live in Polka, Florida, which is a kind of poor town. What can be done to improve education for students that live in towns like mine? Well, you know, unfortunately, a lot of times if you've got uh, a uh, community that is lower income, they don't have as much money in their schools. Uh, a lot of that is state funding, and I want to see states be more fair in terms of how they give money uh, to various schools uh, around their communities. Looks like Harry's got some competition. Damon sat down with the president yesterday, and now he joins us live from the White House. And I will tell you, Bill Plant is strangely missing there. Damon, it is an honor to be talking with you this morning, buddy. Tell me a little bit, you've been campaigning how long to, to speak to the president? For about eight months. And what's it like to finally accomplish your dream? What was he like compared to what you thought he'd be like? Well, President Obama was nice. He gave good details, and he was a very tall person, and he was, I expected him to be like he was. Did he dodge any questions? You know, as a reporter, sometimes you'll ask the president or a politician a question, and they won't answer directly. They'll kind of weave around. Did he answer all your questions directly? Yes, sir. And what, what do you think the most important question was that you asked the president, Damon? Um, how could education be improved with all the cuts? And what are you going to tell the people back who are watching you every day about the president's interview? Well, the president is a normal person. He's a normal person, like a normal guy? Just like you and me? Yes. Well, let's take a look. I want to uh, take a look at one more uh, segment of your interview. Can we pull it up and, and you look, watch on your monitor? When I interviewed Vice President Joe Biden, he became my homeboy. Now that I interviewed you, would you like to become my homeboy? Absolutely. Thank you, man. Thank you. Great job. So, Damon, do you think we need more of that, more politicians and reporters and politicians and their constituents having this homeboy relationship where, where they're friends when everything is done? Well, yes, we do. Because as reporters, they can give away a lot of news, and that we, that's what we need. Well, it is a great honor and a privilege having you on our program. And I'm going to watch the interview again later, take notes, and maybe I'll learn something someday if I get to interview the president. Thank you again. People at home should be really proud of you, buddy. Nice to have you on our show. Thank you. You bet. Damon Weaver with us this morning from the White House.